Uh, dear friends, every year we celebrate World Diabetes Day on 14th of November. Uh, so do we in our country. We in India have a huge and diabetes related problem. 77 million people uh, today suffer from diabetes. And not only the diabetes, if not adequately, properly managed, it escalates again in the form of what it does to kidneys, heart, our vision, nervous system. Uh, many times what we have seen that whenever a diagnosis of diabetes is made, uh, there is a sort of a huge uh, neuropsychiatric distress within the family and to this individual. And many times I've seen that this sort of an attitude towards this lifestyle disease hampers management. Uh, when you have this neuropsychiatric discomfort, when you're in this distress, you don't stick to a diet plan. Uh, you do not uh, do proper exercises. You do not take your medication properly. Negativism and nihilism is not the answer. We also are aware of the fact that we have a huge chunk of population in our country who are relatively less privileged, who live below a poverty line. So it's extremely important, first, that we accept this disease whenever the diagnosis is made. We need to develop coping mechanisms to handle this disorder because it's not so widespread when we talk about 77 million and it's increasing by the million every year. So we have to get general awareness on this World Diabetes Day that yes, we need to educate ourselves about diet, about disease, about proper screening. But most importantly, we should ensure as a community, whenever a diagnosis is made, the family is taken on board. Any friends, colleagues who have had this disorder and are getting treated, their counsel is taken so that that initial days of coping with this new diagnosis are taken care of. I'm sure that with the help of good uh, healthcare providers, uh, peer support, family support, if proper self-care education is given, we'll be able to handle this mammoth problem in the nation adequately and appropriately and allow that this disease to be handled in such a way that it does not harm our body.